The UNI wrestling program finally gets a chance to compete starting here in January, and head coach Doug Schwab loves how his student athletes responded in their preparation through the pandemic. Here's Coach Schwab with an update on the Panther wrestling program. Yeah, you know, I think everyone's trying to manage and deal with it the best you can. You know, the thing is, it's time's moving. You know, so we, we have to still be able to move forward as a group individually. And, you know, and we've had we had some guys that have got knocked out, um, some guys that have had it, they've recovered. Uh, you know, and we just kind of be able to, you got to be able to roll with the punches of, of, of what it's going, what's going on. And you can't really get too worked up about anything that, that comes or rules all of a sudden that change. Um, we just got to be able to control what's right in front of us. And I've uh, been really happy with the training we've been able to get. Uh, you know, we got out of school early. And we have a two month break and you know we've been able to really train and focus on training and been able to have everyone around and, and staying healthy and together. So, uh, you know, I've been, been very pleased with the work that we've done. I've put a lot on these guys too. You know, as far as just work and effort and focus and moving things to another level, um, just from what we're gonna get out of the room because, you know, when we come back, we're, we're coming back really in the middle of our season. You know, we're not coming back like, hey, the start of the season kind of work into things. Like, we're coming back and we'll be in the middle of our season because uh, they, didn't, they didn't move the national tournament. The national tournament is still the same date. And we're starting our, our competitions two months later. So, uh, you know, for us, a, less competitions, maybe a shorter season, but man, just having the opportunity for us to be able to compete, um, for us to be able to have a national tournament. You know, we, we missed out on that last year. <laughs> And uh, I don't, I know none of us forget that. And, and sometimes in the moment we forget it, I think. Uh, but and just having that opportunity again, you know, the, the things that I've been hearing, we're going to have a full, we're going to have a full NCAA tournament. They're not cutting the field. Um, so there's a lot of great things going, going on, going in that room. We've got a young team that I'm excited to, to get the opportunity to go out and compete. And, you know, you're starting to get guys to step up and, you know, really, we're getting kind of where it's like, okay, coach, let's compete. <laughs> you know, we want to get back out there. And we have three guys that have been to national tournaments. Um, you know, obviously Skid, Skid Larzik and, and Carter lost that opportunity last year, but those guys, those guys are back. Uh, Jacob Holshog, who who was an All-American for us a couple years ago. Uh, you know, so we got we have a few guys that have had that experience. Um, you know, we have a lot of other guys that. That haven't. <laughs> you know, we had a we had a great senior class last year that graduated, and and for me it was like there's going to be no drop off. Like just because those guys graduated, like we have some really, really, really good young guys that uh, they're ready to step in and make a mark. They're not waiting to be, you know, okay when I'm when I'm a when I'm a junior or senior. Like there's no guarantee in that. Uh, you know, we have one other guy that. He transferred from Oklahoma State. He's been there for two years. He was at the national tournament, Keegan Moore. You know, so we have a few guys that have had had experience, um, but you know, for the most part, we're going to be a young team um, that's that's young and hungry, and we're going to we're going to make mistakes. But more than anything, we're going to go try to make a name for ourselves. You know, individually and as a group. And and uh, you know, I I don't know if I'm going to point out any anybody in particular. You know, I, I've seen some things that I really, really, really like. Um, out of those guys, and they just got to continue to do it. So for me, it's like you show me do it once. Now, now I want you to be able to do that every time. And then once you do that, start doing it every time. Then I want you to even be able to elevate that. Uh, but I know that there's not a whole lot of maybe talk about you know you and I wrestling or talking you know these about us, and that's fine. It, it, it doesn't that doesn't doesn't bother me. It actually, you know, that, you just put that in the back of your head like, all right, they, they don't think a whole lot of us. We'll go out and we'll, we'll prove them something, you know, we'll prove different. <laughs>